Kwa kwenye mood of the bucket, vicky, vacation mood. Uh, so guys, uh, two, we are going with the SGR, uh, we started at exactly 3 p.m. Uh, we're going to find out how long it takes uh, from Nairobi Terminus to uh, Mombasa Terminus. And yeah, uh, this is first class and I'm going to show you guys uh, how spacious it is. It is really, really spacious. We have enough yellow and uh, bread and soft food and drinks inside and all these kind of things. And it's really, really cheap. It's like 3,000 shillings for adults and 1,500 for children. So this is a total scale and oh, yeah. Hi Nick, why are you being rude? In the morning, uh, at around 9 a.m., we went for breakfast. Then later on, it got cute, and then we took a few pictures. I got someone to take me pictures, a guy from Poland. It was actually so nice. And follow him at David Vector on Instagram. Uh, later on, went for the fun boat. And the fun boat was nice. We got to be the captain and took the uh, boats ourselves. It was really, really fun. It is 1,000 per person for one hour. Hey guys, uh, so today is the I don't know what. We are on the road, uh, just running some few errands and all. But yeah, I'll inform you about everything and how the day goes. But so far, so good. And yeah, that's it. This is the Abadea Nyali. This is the Abadea Nyali. So right now, we are heading for the uh, Mombasa Go Kart. Yay! Today we have a performances from the acrobats and all. So yeah, let's just check them out and see how this one goes.
the next morning woke up with the beach vibes so we went directly to the beach in the morning then afterwards we actually went for breakfast and then came back for swimming yeah Uh, hi guys, so today we are at the Jesus Museum. Uh, so far so good, I'm liking the place. So we are being told about the brief history about the place. And um, yeah, that's just basically it about the Portuguese, about how it started, about every room, every how they were ready for war. And I'm going to just clip in, chip in some few clips. And yeah, let's just see how I'm going to share the experience definitely. So yeah. Portuguese. And Vasco da Gama was meant to serve as an adversary in northern India. So, merchant and sailors used to come here by the government or to expand their powers after a break of 100 years, which is 1593. So, they sent a new force being manned by Alpha Breta and a dear leader. So, they reached in Mombasa and capture all these ports up to Lamu side again. And that's when they take an interest of building this big fortress. then lucky enough to find someone fishing so we took a look and he actually managed to catch one uh, and he went directly uh, to prepare a meal of his own for dinner <laughs> 